All right. Um, first, the Bucks. The Bucks. Then, unboxing. Unboxing. The box, unboxing, maybe a little bit of B-roll. Oh yeah guys, here it is. So the huge thing about this setup, this is the first wireless pen tattoo machine on the market. Uh, which I think is very cool. So let's start with the batteries. Here it is. Uh, the batteries, they last for about four and a half to five hours. If you leave it on nonstop, they take about an hour and a half to fully charge. The kit includes two batteries. When one is charging, you use the other one, then you switch them. So you're sure you're always gonna be good. First thing, everyone asked me about the batteries. Are they heavy? The battery weight about 55 gram, which is it's 0 0.14 pound, so it's, it's, it is very light. The kit includes a power supply, very small, very light. The power supply have different options, kickstart, boost mode, the jack for your cord, plug for the foot switch, power plug here, and the USB plug for some updates and to plug with the Neo Rail, which is something super cool I'm gonna talk in a second. Attached to it is the power bay, it's very simple. You also have a wireless foot switch, that I forgot at the shop. Last forever, which is super cool. Then cables again, cables. Here's the Neo Rail. This is a very, very nice improvement by Ink Machine. It's made to organize all of your needle on your station. I'm gonna show you how it works in a second. It's great. And now you have the Scorpion Machine. So very light machine, very short. There's a plug for the RCA cable, clip cord. Here's the battery connection here. There's a screw here to adjust the length of your needle. The grip is removable, replaceable. The stroke of this machine is four mils. There's two options to adjust the give of the machine. You have two magnets, the white one and the red one. The red one is the stronger one. The white one is the standard one. Uh, if you need the machine to run harder, you put the red and lighter, you put the white one. Uh, I'm used to use the red one and it works perfectly. This machine is only compatible with the Neo cartridges from Ink Machine, uh, so no standard cartridges. Uh, but you'll see, I'm gonna show you how they work and they work great. All right, so let's see how the machine works. You'll see it's a very, very easy setup to use. First, you take a machine, take a battery, and you're pretty much good to go. Uh, another cool thing about those batteries, they have a sensor, so they know which machine we are using. Let's say I wanna use this one here. The machine's running, turn it off. You take the other one, and the machine's gonna run. The Neo Rail, you'll see how cool this thing is. All right, so let's say I have this machine running with this needle. See the needle right now, it's at 7.7 .7 volt. If I switch my needle, I grab another one. So this one's gonna be at 9.4. The Neo Rail is gonna remember the voltage of each slot. When you unclip the needle, you just stick it here. The machine's gonna stop by itself because the Neo Rail is connected to the power supply. Then you grab the other one and you're good to go. It's a very efficient setup. It's made to be convenient. It's a very well-made setup to avoid any cross-contamination. Everything is very easy to bag. All the needles are organized and easy to deal with. All right, guys, so to finish, I'm just gonna give you my quick pros and cons so you have a better idea if the machine's worth it or not for you. Uh, so let's start with the cons. Getting used to the length of the machine. Uh, the machine is very, very short, especially when there's a battery on. It was tricky for me to place my hand like what I'm used to. After a few days, I I'm just got used to it and now I place the machine a little bit differently and now everything's fine. Needle, yeah. To adjust the needle, you have to turn the screw here. 
when the machine is all bagged, it's a little bit harder to manage compared to the other machine where the adjustment is on the grip. I find it a little bit harder to manage. Nothing big. I'm just saying. Uh, yeah, also compared to another machine like the FKRN Zion, this machine have two options to adjust your give. The other have 10. For someone who's very, very picky on how the machine's running, you have less option with this one. It is absolutely not a problem for me. I'm just thinking less option. So again, I'm just saying. The machine is a little bit harder to bag, but you know, it's wireless. The other ones are not. Having this, it's impossible to just put a clip cord sleeve on it. You have to bag it with a, a bottle bag, tape it and all that. It's, it's, it's nothing crazy. It's just harder than what we're used to, but it's also wireless. And the last thing, it's more stuff to deal with. For someone who likes everything simple and fast, the machine's harder to bag. You have to be sure the batteries are charged. You have to bag the power supply and the neo rail. You have to plug the neo rail into the power supply. So it's just a little bit more stuff to deal with. When you're used to grab your machine, bag it, being pretty much good to go, this one's gonna take a five, 10 minutes more to set up. Now the pros. It's a really, really good machine. It's light, it's steady, it feels like a precision tool. I don't know if it's the cartridges or the machine. Everything feels very, very precise. You don't feel the needles moving. You feel like it's going where you want. It's really easy to make a good saturation. Yeah, obviously it's wireless, super cool. Technology feels smooth, easy, secure. The fact that everything is made to avoid cross-contamination, I think it's perfect. Having more organization, super cool. Yeah, good feel with the machine. It's yeah, man, I love it. I've been using it for the past month and a half. I brought it with me in convention. Honestly, it's it's a really, really good setup. So guys, if you have any question, just write some comments below. I'll be more than happy to answer all of your question. Let me know what you think. My first review, uh, I try, I really, really try to make it short, a lot of information very fast. So let me know and I'll try to adjust. So if you like that video, subscribe, like, comment, share all of it. I'm going to see you at the next one. Thank you.